Hi guys, Shino Gaming here. Um, I found the first replay I ever played on Attila, right? And this is gonna be the Sassana Empire versus the Huns. And this was like the first part like I ever played on Attila, like ever. This was me trying out the game and feel of it. And I've been playing Rome 2 like for ages. So this was me trying the game out. So uh, my army comp basically, uh, my front line is four elite mo immortals. On the right flank, there's two elite Dalmite infantry backed up by Royal Persian archers. Backing up my elite immortals are uh, just standard Dalamite infantry, which is a mid-tier infantry. Uh, backing up them is uh, my general on a stamp bed thing. It's a medium melee cav. I have an Indian elephant and a Nafadun. So it's pretty interesting. Pretty interesting uh, flanking force as well. All of my archer force is on this flank. So, uh, yeah. And the enemy army, uh, they have two Ua archers, uh, four Hunnic spears, uh, four Borfan warriors, two steppe warriors. Uh, his general is on a step chieftain, uh, a Hunnic mounted war, and then there's two Hunnic mounted warband and a step lancers. The step lance is a light shot cav, but still, if he can get some rear charges with it, it's going to do very well. He has a <laughs> very light melee, which is going to do very badly. His medium melee, he's not one to engage because it's his general. So his only cav really that's going to work is his general. It's all pretty light, and the only cavalry I actually have is my general. So, yeah, he can probably outflank me a lot. But my front force of these spears are very, very elite. Very elite. These uh, elite immortals, if you've seen the film 300 Spartans, these were the elite guys that um, the Persian king sent in uh, as the last dish effort to try and beat the Spartans. And eventually they did and then they killed them with like tons of arrows and stuff. Spoiler alert, yep. My Dolomite infantry will do pretty decently against the enemy swordsmen and axemen. And on this flank, especially my elite Dolomite infantry, will do very, very well against uh, anything he throws on this flank. And I have Persian Royal Archers, which will really help out. But his spears right in the front are pretty useless. They're pretty crappy. Really. They're like, they're pretty crap. They're not really that good. But they're medium tier, but they're not that bad. But I have these nafs because I kind of thought, well, naff tunes were so, like, OP in medieval. Why wouldn't they be OP in Attila? So I thought I'd try it out. But I'm going to have to assault the hill because the player isn't moving. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to move up my archers. But then I move my archers up and he starts charging down. And he has all these, like, cattle traps and stuff because he's the defender. He has like cow traps, uh, he has sharp stone beds and stuff, but he's literally just going to ignore his defensive position and charge through them. But uh, the funny thing was, he put down these cow traps, but I was looking here and I was like, is he actually going to charge his cavalry through these cow traps? Like, seriously? He does the exact same on this flank and charges cavalry straight through the cow traps and kills tons of his own cavalry. But his cavalry are throwing... What are they throwing? Oh no, these are bow cav. Hunting warband or oh, bow cav, right? I didn't know that. But I'm pulling back my archers because he's starting to fire and his infantry is really getting quite forward. Uh, my immortals are throwing peeler and I'm going to charge them forward. Charging this flank. He has to deal with all of his spears. Moving infantry this way. I'm always keeping this unit in reserve and just slowly marching it forward. Because if I move this unit, I don't want to expose myself too much. But he has these archers right here, which... Is he moving them into melee? Yeah, he's moving his archers into melee. Really, really bad idea. I, he has so much infantry on this front, I really don't get why he did that. 
He really doesn't need to, but he is still going to fire with this back unit. Firing straight into my general, getting no kills. But he is firing at our general. He's rallying his units to try and keep his guys together. He's got all this cavalry trying to charge into this unit. And my spears caught his cavalry right here. And he has this hunting warband, uh, which is the light melee, trying to get through to my archers. But I just get my Nafatoons to throw a volley. And they totally missed. They get one kill. Uh, I think I had them on fire at will. But I kept uh, some Dalamite warriors, which I'm going to put into this fight. I'm reinforcing with Dalamite infantry into this blob. I've still got my archers here firing in. I'm moving elite Dalamite infantry around the flanks. And uh, his cavalry step lancers are routing off the field. But they are coming back. They're coming back. And uh, I have my nafs. Which I am giving an order to throw into this blob. Which is really going to get nice, nice kills. I think get it right here. And I'm still firing straight into this blobby bit here. And this immortal right here was very out of position. I was trying to redo it, but it wasn't doing it. It was like in a line, it was curving out. But he got a rear charge with his cavalry. It really doesn't matter for me. I have a, still got my infantry and an immortal fighting a unit of both fan, both fan warriors. I have this infantry all the way up here. Like I gave an order to march and I marched it way too far. So I don't realize yet but I need to pull it back and I see his general like in the last minute like literally after he charges like he gets caught and I see it and I move my infantry round to fight and yeah, this is when I start making orders to put them back in. And let's just do a big blob fire right here. Some nice close-ups. Uh, there's just tons of fighting right here. Uh, archers in here. Both fan warriors. And I've got Dalamite warriors all across this front. Immortals still fighting in here. Holding out since the start of the game. They're getting a little outflanked here by some step warriors. But that's fine. I have this elephant back here, which I've given order to charge in. I really need to give it a run order, as these guys are going to get no combat at all. Uh, these guys, I they threw their volley of bombs at that cavalry, and they don't have anything left. There's still a few units engaging. I have some down, elite down my infantry that I charged down, which was contacted by some Bose fan warriors, uh, which is going to be heavy versus heavy, but my guys will win. Because all I do is just charge through with some elephants. So my elephants uh, racking up some kills. Racking up 60 kills now. Not enough though. There's so many routing units and stuff. And yeah, that was um, the re my first battle that I ever played on Attila. Like, it was really fun for me to play. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.